Yeah. Harry. Can I see play Street Fighter or not Street Fighter? He always does this. Every time a new DLC character comes out, he always uses him for like the first week or two after you back in. And I just love seeing the way Halberd treats those characters. But starting off into this game, uh, he's missing the grab conversions, but Terry is able to actually get so much off of grab. Yeah, and that's up the base base one. Let's see. Okay, Castle landing with Fair. All right, Smith. Oh, he thought he could get on. I mean, it's... Wow, just reading the cross up so well. Oh, help with all the matter. I think it'd be better just to get the up B. Mm -hmm. I know the up B kills, right? Uh, the up B, yes. Yeah. Oh, I'm surprised that Power Wave didn't really explode the bomb, which is like, I thought it'd be fire property, you know? Fire property didn't explode the bomb. Um, that's interesting. Yeah, uh, I'm not really sure why it didn't explode it either. But right now, like, it's insane just like. How many mix up Terry has out of his jabs and his tilts? You know, he like you see um, the help with already like racking up like percents in the 30s into the 40s and off of 60 off of like a uh, one series of conversions. So it's really really menacing. Well, first off, helper already got the sub up already, but I think he's trying to find another opening. I think it's not letting I have it because he's like he's like jumping out of the uh, combos and making sure he's he's the eyeing away from it too. And right now, uh, I think it's a really, really great choice to up for the okay. bomb. Oh, wow. That didn't look like it was on the kill, too. Okay. Okay, <laughs> yeah, so grab here, too. Up air. Is that the basic combo for Terry? Um, I don't believe it's up air. Maybe I, I think it might be down throw into up tilt and maybe neutral air. Something along those lines. Because normally you do like the falling up air. And, and you'd get uh, so much mileage off of that as well. But right now, like, Halpu is at a very dangerous percent for Dingus because not only does he have the rage mechanic, he has go active. Yeah. Um, oh. Oh, that would wow. be so sick if he got enough to parry. Okay, let's see back. Let's see, Albert to anti here more. No, I really love Dingus' use of bomb recoveries, but I feel like they could be. I feel like right now he's just more so using them for the sake of using them rather than to position himself better in order to recover. If that makes uh, a little bit of sense. Yeah, he's just trying to like use the bomb a lot of in this matchup. Right? It's like it's kind of working out for him, but at the same time, that's like his like ninety percent of his gameplay. That was a really great edge guard from Dingus, exploiting Terry's awful uh, ledge net mechanics. And with that out, um, he could go out of the way now. He should have been more relaxed, but this percent is still climbing up even more higher. Okay, there's a grab in here, fast throw. He doesn't have any. Uh, kills, I don't right? believe so. Yeah, but so he don't. does have throw kill confirms. Yeah, and that's like all he needs really. Mm -hmm. Nice Ooh. timing. Oh, I like that mix up. Instead of he just usually he just supposed to bump on himself, but this time he just tosses. And right now you just see like this is definitely like where help uh well I'm sorry, Terry got the yeah. struggle in a lot of matchups and that is actually getting in on the opponent. Um, you know, like Link definitely plays keep away, you know, with some of the best in the game. Um, Boomerang, Arrow, and Bomb, and there's Oh! Oh, well, I guess it is the power dunk with the, the, the one you slam on the ground on the floor. That. Huh. <laughs> it's that. And I'm pretty sure it's not the RUK okay sign. Oh, wait, it might be actually. Wait, that might be. Wait. I might be wrong on that. Can you replay that? Cause I'm pretty sure it might be just the side B, or the down, or the, the neutral B one. Yeah, that one. It's a side B one. That was, yeah, that it was, was the busted wolf. Yeah, that was. Cause he does, he does a little like push out. See, that's a side B. Yeah. One. Yeah. He punches out. That's a side B one. I can't believe that traded. That. That's ins That is so insane. That is so good. And that's he traded crazy. with the dish. He <laughs> traded with Link spoiler on that. That's absolutely naughty. <laughs> game two, going to Kalos. Um, this is, I think, a much better stage for Link in this kind of a matchup. But as soon as I say that, Elbow <laughs> is able to get a clean 28% of the jab, jab, down beat. Yeah, this was a really basic move at the beginning of the match. And it still goes down for like that later percents too. Mm -hmm. Because like most jabs in the game, you don't have either a set amount of knockback or just so little knockback that it doesn't go anywhere. Exactly. And opponents would have to like preemptively DI that. It's back an air dodge. Ah, oh, the boomerang interrupted it. 
But yeah. you know, as soon, you know, as I said that, like Dingus, I feel like in this game is doing like a much better job right now, like playing patiently, which is trying to lead help his movements a little bit with like these non committal options. Yeah. And like racking up the damage. But help catching the whift up smash, I a little bit questionable spacing. Maybe he was trying to lead a jump in of some sort. Down smash, still alive. One more. That was down so he meant to do down smash like that. But it doesn't matter, S match to your face. And I feel like in that situation, that's when you'd want to, as Link, that's when you'd want to optimally bomb Blue Cover, right? Because you're going from so deep and you don't want to recover predictably with that upbeat. Um, but help Blue really, really aware and able to punish it. Um, well, I think Terry's one of his very first best stages should be Yoshi Island. Yoshi's Island? Yeah. They'll kill super early, cover the platforms really, really, really well. Um, I feel like that's definitely a stage you want to be striking against it. Um, but help like catching these really, really aggressive landings from Link, um, you know, with like those F smashes. I feel like Dingus has to be a little bit more reserved. Um, oh, he's trying to get the dunk there again. He, miss, uh, he misplaces a uh, move. Get somebody up B. Punish him that one. I'll see. Bad with the boomerang. Alright. I mean, I really, really like Dingus' coinage pressure, but then you just started to see him retreat with those boomerangs, and in a way that like gave Helper the stage control back for the moment. Yeah, exactly. I, I don't, I don't like the idea of it. You're just giving up stage control to the opponent. Mm -hmm. I mean, but eventually you, you get an opening like that. I feel like more than enough to kill him. Was it 180 something percent? Yeah, that's super late though. At some point, you could have gotten a stop in an earlier move that kills early. Yeah. And something else I've noticed about Dengus is I see him opt for up smashes out of shield as opposed to like the classic like Link up B out of shield that he's really, really known for. I, th I feel like Link up B out of shield will not only like be more consistent, but it's also dramatically faster than up smash. Whoa. Ooh. What was that, dash attack or side B? I think that was, no, that was definitely dash attack, but I do believe it was a little bit of questionable DI coming from Dengus' part because it was just, uh, yeah, yeah. he was just drifting off really, really slowly. That definitely wasn't an early kill. All right. Uh, Thing is, needs to climb his health back here. Like he's at zero, which is a good start, but like he just needs to get this kill to happen right now before Helper dash and more opponents uh, percent on him. Oh, is that kind of rough? That's not like it did. And right now, you like see you see Helper doing like a fantastic job of adapting to a lot of Dingus' timings on his rising aerials. You like see Dingus. Every time he's in the air, like he's throwing out a back air, he's throwing out a falling forward and a falling now. And Helper is just like dashing back slightly and whiff punishing with a grab. Oh, almost gets hit by the fair. It does his away. Oh, Ooh. you thought. You actually thought. <laughs> that thing is going to help laughing combat. it off. Knowing <laughs> exactly what he intended to do with that interaction. Yeah. That's how I can cover the uh, landing. Oh, he got the toughest in the landing with the SMAT again. He got the Regis. He needed to, like, he was off by a few pixels on the spacing of it. Um. And like normally, like you wouldn't see anybody going through like these really aggressive options, like F smashes in neutral like that. No, but just Helper has like such a confident lead on where Dingus is going to be at any given moment. Um, and right now, I feel like Dingus needs to find a way to like to get some space in between him and Helper because Helper is just like rushing it down. It, it's working. Space. It's working out the way he's doing it because Helper just keeps going in regardless of all these projectiles he has in his face. Jumps out and hits us. Still alive. Has no second jump, but really? What? Okay, yeah. It's alive though, and no, it doesn't go up for another edge grab move. Oh, that was so sick! The boomerang caught the ball. He's so alive. Yeah. What? Oh my god. That was a, that was a good e three KO squeeze. And then, oh, get the grab and he has here. go I'll active. This is kill. super super menacing. Kalos has one of the highest ceilings in the game. <gasps> no way! Oh, he's alive. Oh, he got the third Gets out there again. No, you're sealing it, bro. You can't do that again. I feel like Dinga should have opted to throw him off stage. That's um, Terry's biggest weak point. Could have thrown uh, off the boomerang. Grab it! No, he goes away. Uh, Copper. <laughs> and again, you see Dinga's going through these up throws, just like staling it further. Okay. Um, this is really, really dangerous. Reverses up. He didn't get hit by it though. Okay, get another push strong there. Oh, and was still alive. Oh no, but Dinga's no. What Dingus happened? Dinga was intending to bomb recover. But instead, Helper was able to drift in and get hit by it. And as a That's result, crazy. Dingus didn't get the momentum he needed to recover. Wow. Oh, you didn't get hit by that at all. That's nuts. I just saw the replay on that one, too. Wait, can you put on the replay for that? I, so, I saw it on my back to so, so you see Helper. Here. Ooh, yeah. Dingus <laughs> misspaced his that? bomb. That looked like it hit, too. Yeah. 
Huh. Uh, was that be and it had helped have been just like a few pixels to the other side, like you'd have been blasted into the blast zone and, he, yeah. and the game would have ended completely differently. 